Hey, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David, and this is a deck review. Hey, today we're going to look at the Magicon decks from 2012 and Dan and Dave. What is Magicon? I'll tell you. Magicon is a conference uh, for those who are serious about the art of magic and where those in attendance, they then share ideas, insight, and they just have a common experience of you know, working together towards the advancement of the art form of cardistry and magic. Now, Dan and Dave, they would say that it's their mission to advance the art of magic, so Magicon then provides this platform for some of magic's smartest thinkers, their greatest visionaries, and top performers. Plus, not to mention there's presentations, there's behind the scenes stuff, there's art, there's science, Anything that has to do with the technology of magic is at MagicCon. The MagicCon 2012 conference was in San Diego, California on April 12th through the 15th. Like I said, it is the premier conference for magicians. And if you'd like to learn more, you can visit magic-con.org. The front of the tuck case, of course, says MagicCon and has the five-pointed star. And you're also gonna have another little five-pointed star right there on the tuck flap. On the bottom, there's some ad copy about MagicCon and Dan and Dave. And the back design is a glimpse of what the back design of the cards looks like. That is pretty much it for the tuck case. Let's take a look at these cards. These cards were, of course, printed from the United States Playing Card Company, and they do come on their retail stock. They do have air cushion finish and a modern emboss. And if you'd like to learn more about stock cut or finish, you can click the link below in the description. The back design of these cards is a five-pointed star amidst a kaleidoscope of color and a nice thick white border. Magicon so far has always included the star icon as its symbol. With this deck you're going to get two extras. You're going to get a Dan and Dave ad card as well as an ad card that tells you a little bit about Magicon. Ports in this deck are somewhat standard. They have had most of their color removed except for a tiny little hint of purple. They've also had their borders removed and then the entire image has been blown up just a smidge. The pips and indice cards are going to look completely standard to you, however the coloring is a little different. The red in this deck is almost kind of like a light, light, light magenta. Uh, I won't say pink because that's just too girly, but uh, it is a soft color which is nice. And then the black cards almost look black but they're actually a very real dark deep shade of purple. Alright, so that is my review of the MagicCon 2012 deck from Dan and Dave. As always, we recommend that you like this video just so other people can find it faster. We also recommend that you subscribe to this channel just to stay up to date on the latest in cards and card magic. Now, if you want to follow me on social media, you can. I'm at facebook.com slash magic orthodoxy, twitter.com slash magic orthodoxy, and instagram.com slash magic underscore orthodoxy. Thanks. Bye.